June 16, 2021. How's it going, guys? Got another video for you. Well, I went out this morning real early, drove around a little bit, and uh, try to beat the heat here before it gets too warm today. And I wanted to show you guys a couple of things, so we'll just get moving here. Some clouds out early this morning here, early. This was just uh, probably around 6 a.m., maybe a little bit before. Not very much humidity this morning. That humidity is low, it's not too bad. First thing I was going to talk about this morning is something up here. It's not too far up the road here. I'll just stop right there for a second. You see this old lot over here? That used to not be just an old lot. That used to be where uh, Taco John's used to be. There was a building that was there originally. And you see that... Uh, thrift store vehicle that's on the other side there was actually a metal fence that went all the way across there divided that between where that bus is and where that other vehicle is but what i noticed in the last week here there's been a vehicle sitting here another one doesn't have no license plates on it and uh the door is open on the vehicle. It's an SUV. It's a maroon SUV up there. And the door is just halfway open on it. And it's sitting back here on this fence line back here. It's weird. Because, I mean, you know, it just, uh, you know, we got lots of different people, homeless people stuff going up and down 40 Highway and stuff. And if these things are abandoned and you don't know what's going to be also living in them, because they'll try to find anything just to stay in. I don't know. That caught my eye. Like I say, I've been watching it. And, and since the door is now hanging open on it, that's kind of strange, guys. So hold on. Okay, guys, I'm back. And I'm making my turn here at 7-Eleven up here by Big Boys. And I noticed that vehicle sitting over there again. Now, that was supposed to be one of those city workers, I believe, was sitting over there. And this is just the most funkiest thing. I mean, I've never seen nothing like this before. I mean, my dad, he worked for... I don't know how many years there as a supervisor over convenience stores and filling stations. I don't know, 25, 30 years. I don't know how long he had been doing it. But what I notice it's odd about this is this vehicle. I've got a time stamp here. And like I said, the time's not accurate on here. But this is 1537. Okay, guys? And I mean, people come, people go, but it's it's always something weird back here, either by that dumpster or stuff. I don't know. I just think, you know, you know, we've seen so many people doing drugs. We've seen people doing homeless that have gone back there and passed out back behind the dumpster. Uh, I, a while back, somebody even lit one of those uh, lantern deals that flies through the air. I mean, it was a wonder it didn't catch big boys over there on fire because it was flying over their roof over there that I showed. But this is just odd. I don't know. It's weird. But hold on. Okay, guys. Now, there's my time stamp there. A 1621. And there's that vehicle still sitting there. Still back there. Hold on. Let's see if I get focused. All right. I'm back. I mean, that's what, about 43 minutes? 43 minutes. Like I said, I drove around a little bit and stuff there. I want to show you uh, something else. I want to show you that carnival that's going in up there. Hold on. Okay, guys, I'm back again. 
And this was another, like I said, another, when I went back around, I went around a couple, three times. I drove up by Costantino's, <clears throat> went over there by Gordman's and Burlington Co. Factory back and forth and stuff over all the way around and stuff. But that's odd. I mean, that's really odd. And I noticed, okay, this vehicle stopped, pulled in. And what's even more weird is check this out. Okay, guys. Now, across the way, when that other car is over there with that vehicle, this is on the back side over here at Big Boys. There's a motorcycle across the way watching. Now, I don't know. Maybe nothing. Maybe somebody working it at, at around 6 a.m. up here at Big Boys on a motorcycle. Could be. I don't know. But it's like they, you know, some of this stuff, you know, they sit like from one area to the other and they watch, okay? And like I say, this might just be all coincidence, but I don't get it. So hold on. Okay, guys, I'm back. Let's get on to something fun here. Anyway, it looks like the carnival's going in up there. They're going to be on that other side over there, which is probably a good thing. They're not going to be over on that other side. So, I mean, at least that's away from that old abandoned car on the other, across the street there. So maybe nothing will happen on that since nothing's happened. Nobody's removing it or getting it removed. And I thought that was kind of cool. So it looks like they'll be up there this weekend. Looks like that could be some fun, guys. Now look at those clouds. Isn't that something, too? Wow, looking clouds it's early this morning. Anyway, keep your eyes open, guys, and stay safe out there. Have a good one.